Hey yo, what's up everybody? It's Overking here, back with another video. And today, we are back with the Smash Brothers Amiibo Tournament. But before we get started, I real quickly want to plug my Discord server, just because I want to get some Amiibo tournaments set up there, and possibly just some general Smash Bros if anybody wants to come down and play. But, and that'll be in the link in, linked in the description below. But today's bracket, we have a full roster of 16 with four newcomers. We have the Loftwing and Sl Zelda Amiibo, the Metroid Dread Samus, the Inkling Boy Amiibo, and the Pikachu Amiibo. All here for the tournament today. And before you guys ask, yes, Villager's video will be coming out soon. I'm just not sure what to do with him. So he'll be sitting off to the side just because I feel like there's some fun stuff I could do, but I'm not sure what I want to do yet. But without further ado, let's get into it with our first match. Ryu versus Zelda. And then after that, we'll have Pikachu and Alex. We'll have Ivysaur and Terry. Oh, wait, Ivysaur and Duck Hunt. I apologize, Terry. Terry and Steve. Inkling and Bowser Jr. We'll have Bowser versus Min Min. We'll have DK versus Samus. We'll have Inkling Boy versus Byleth. And yes, this tournament is going to be awesome as our first and probably last tournament with a full 16 people. Now let's get into it. And I did make sure to keep the two Steve, the Steve and Alex on the same side and the Inkling and the Inkling on the same side just so they could not have to fight each other in the finale for a boring finale. But we're going to start this off with Ryu versus Zelda. Now, this is going to be an interesting one, because Zelda has Final Smash meter, and if anyone's seen Zelda Final Smash, this is about to get interesting. But we're going to start off with Ryu taking some instant percentage damage. Wow, okay. Ryu's coming out with the big buck damage, and actually, speaking of stages, we're actually on Zelda stage, the Skyloft. Because this is Leg this is Skyward Sword Zelda, after all, so I figured I'd give her her own stage. And to be fair, she's with Loftwing, so. Actually, is this the same? Wait, I'm kind of curious, which game does this Zelda come from? I think I'm going to look this up, just as they get into the first few minutes of the match. I might actually up the timer next turn, just for, like, the sake of everything normal. Uh, what game is is the Smash Bros. Zelda from. It is based off of... Ultimate game, each character is based... Oh, wow! Ryu with the first stock instantly. Okay, I don't know. I can't find it. But there's a Smash Ball on the field. This could be Zelda's chance to come back. Unless she's going to be the first one eliminated. To be fair, this is Zelda. And without Final Smash, she's kind of worthless. Um, I think we're just going to keep watching this happen. And we're going to move straight into... I think this is Bowser's stage. Oh, Zelda's Final Smash is here. This isn't going to be enough to kill, I don't think. Yeah, no, that's not enough to kill. I think Zelda's just going to have to pray for a sudden death roll. But honestly, in her situation, oh, she might be lucky to get that. This is going to be interesting. But also, real quickly before this match continues, I think out of all the amiibo I've gotten, I think either the M the EMMI amiibo I just got, because I got the Metroid and the Samus and that amiibo 2 pack i think either the emmi is my favorite amiibo or this loftwing zelda or this could just be new buyer's remorse but <laughs> outside of that i think ryu's just gonna take this one absolutely swatting zelda out of here i doubt there's any chance for a comeback 30 seconds ryu could easily take a stock off zelda in this time and it looks like he's got final smash rolling up so unless Zelda can get Ryu to get off the final smash, this is gonna, probably going to be an easy kill for... Yep, that's it. Ryu mo probably moves on in the bar bracket. I'm just going to call it now. Zelda is the first one eliminated. That's kind of sad, but at least we won't have all of our newcomers being winners this time. So that at least works out. 
Oh, so Ryu is the first to continue on. That'll be an interesting amiibo to build. I have to learn the combos for a Ryu amiibo. Oh, that's that's gonna suck. But our next matchup, most importantly, is our brand new Pikachu amiibo and Alex. Now, honestly, if Pikachu is to win this tournament, I know 100% what I'm doing with this amiibo. Like, there is not a second doubt in my mind what I'm doing with this amiibo. And trust me, I think it'll be absolutely hilarious, even if it's not that great of an amiibo. One sec, I gotta get my amiibo lined up for the bracket. Okay, yes, I am actually setting these guys up in real life. Honestly, you know what? If I had a webcam or some way to record my real life, I would record the tournament bracket in real life as I did the tournament, but <laughs> that could be interesting. But speaking of everything, this is actually our, our second stage shared between two amiibo. It's our double Splatoon Inkling stage. Ooh, wow, these guys are really going at it at this bottom at ledge. That could have been a perfect opportunity for Pikachu to get that down spike. Destroy that first stock off Alex before it even happened. Ooh, wow, this is this is such a fiery match. Steve is placing blocks on a stage with a bunch of platforms. What? Okay, interesting. Also, by the way, real quickly, something I'm very excited about is I got both the Bayonetta games. But, well, and I'm waiting for the third one to come out to get that one. So, I mean, like, I'd possibly record it, but I'd probably play through it first just to see what it was. But, yeah, that's just unrelated. I'm just really excited to play those games. I haven't played them yet, and overall, it's one of the few Nintendo games I've actually been excited to play through. But I don't know if I'd ever get Splatoon 3. It probably takes some convincing, but... To be fair, there probably won't be another Splatoon games for God knows how long. Ooh, on to Ryu's stage. We're still not going to see the new stage for Pikachu or Samus. Wait, I, did I, I... I have to remember. Did I actually enable Pikachu's stage? That would be very embarrassing if I didn't. Ooh, Pikachu got hit by the first Final Smash. But then again, Alex is at 100 and something percent. 164? Yep. Ooh, that's going to take Pikachu down a stock. I mean, I'm amazed that he was very low right then and there. But will Pikachu be able to get off the kill before the 49 seconds pass by? Because this is overall one of the short and longest lasting games we've had. One of our amiibo is down to one stock and that's it. I really hope this Pikachu can do something here. Yep, that looks like a stock unless the Alex amiibo can somehow live that. Honestly, I think the st ban on Steve would be justified at that rate, even though I, I, I personally don't like it. I think no ban would be fine. Just no bans on any characters, and then we could continue the rest of our lives without banning. Even though I guess banning does keep the game balanced, but, you know, who knows. Oof. Poor, poor Pikachu. Even though, then again, I'm not a pro Smash player, so I wouldn't have very much of an opinion. But this is going to be an interesting one. We're going to sudden death on one of the weirdest stages in the world. We'll s Ooh, Pikachu got it. Which means Alex, one of our former best, our second place in the la in our very first tournament bracket, has gotten out round one, I believe, both times. Which means Ryu versus Pikachu will be our next matchup. Okay, Duck Hunt versus Pokemon Trainer. Also, if you haven't noticed, I did forget to save all the data from our Amiibo last time. I will not forget this Amiibo tournament. I apologize for that. But we're going to continue in with an Ivysaur Duck Hunt do uh, uh, fight. I think I've got to I've got to check what our last bracket was. I've got to remember which one Amiibo fought which ones because I did kind of set up this bracket with the Steven with Steven Alex and the t what are the other two? God, I hate myself. And the uh, uh, Inkling and Inkling Amiibo being w with each other. I did set that one up. But it looks like there's no doubling up this tournament. Yeah, I'm just looking at it now. It doesn't look like we'll have any duo matches or repeat matches. But now, what was our first bracket? Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm looking through this, and it doesn't look like we've got anything like that again to this time either. So, good. I did a good job. Ooh, but nice, Ivysaur. You're on the good percent. 
But right now, I'm personally going to think about getting rid of the ability to switch Pokemon on Ivysaur. Because it's kind of annoying me that the Ivysaur amiibo can switch into the other amiibo. Even though, then again, that's just Pokemon Trainer's whole shtick. But will Duck Hunt be able to KO Charizard with the heaviness of the character? Oh, okay, never mind. Just prove me wrong. Thank you, Duck Hunt. I think Squirtle's the best Pokemon to hit this Spinal Smash with. Because even if he doesn't kill, this is... I mean, there's, it's probably the highest chance to kill out of all the Pokemon that get. Ooh, Duck Hunt. You're a little screwed here, buddy. But then again, we're only halfway through this match. So this could go anywhere. Ooh, Duck Hunt stage. I think every time Duck Hunt has gotten his own stage as one of the stage wars, he has won. So I could be completely wrong, and I'm sure no one will correct me or care. But yeah. Oh. Oh, wow. Um, so Pokemon Trainer might be a little screwed over here. Because, I mean, Ivysaur, I apologize, not Pokemon Trainer. I keep looking over at Charizard playing, and I'm like, Ivysaur, that doesn't sound right. But it looks like Duck Hunt might have just pulled this one off. He survived the final smash, and it looks like he's about to take a second stock off poor little Ivysaur, which I think is our worst performing amiibo throughout all the tournaments. I might make a tier list or something, like a ranking at like the end of the month, or every four tournament brackets. No, every three tournament brackets, maybe. Because we'll have three winners... Whoopsie daisy. I've just got to make sure I didn't just break an amiibo. Even though it is kind of interesting because to all of our winners so far, well, the two winners we've got have not lost. I mean, have not been in more than one amiibo bracket, which would make it pretty hard to judge them. So, yeah. Ooh, 10 minute seconds. That's it, Ivysaur. I think Duck Hunt just completely destroyed you. Which means our bottom places are Zelda... Alex, Ivysaur so far. Yep, not even going to get a stock off. Dude, poor Ivysaur is just getting destroyed in these tournaments. Duck Hunt Dog wins. Whew. Which leaves our next matchup, Terry versus Steve. And actually, if you guys were running, wondering, my very first amiibo is Incineroar. But my very first, like, DLC amiibo, or very first one I got on release date, is Terry. So, I think that's just an interesting fact. Ooh, Samus' stage is up. I, I chose this one because there's not really a Metroid Dread sta a stage in the game, but... Interesting, I thought Steve's walking animation just broke for a sec. Yeah, but honestly, I, I would love it if in the next Smash game we got some Metroid Dread representation with EMMI, because I feel like that would be a pretty cool character. Like, I've never even played Metroid Dread, nor do I plan on a 2 until Christmas at most. I mean, at least. But this figure, this amiibo figure just makes me want him in Smash. No, but he's too big, like Ridley. Maybe we can get a second Ridley-like character. I just like those long, lanky characters. Oh, jeez. I forgot what this stage did for a sec. Steve was at the nice percent, but I think this might be the most even match of Smash we've had for these Amiibo tournaments so far in this bracket. Because I feel like Ryu kind of swept easily. Pikachu went to sudden death, but we all knew Pikachu would win sudden death. And then Ivysaur kind of just got swept by a Duck Hunt dog. I don't know why I add the do dog, but who knows. I did just get a bunch of ducks, so I, I think that's pretty fun. Sorry, I love ducks. Out of all the birds that I dislike, I love ducks. Ooh, that's dead for him. Ooh, will Terry be able to make it? No. Terry just committed some pactol. I, I pronounced that wrong. I feel like people are going to get mad at me for being insensitive. But we're halfway through this fight, and we are tied. Ooh, but is Steve going to get the... No, he's not going to get the kill before Terry can get his final smash. Even with ignoring, like, the stage and everything, I don't think Terry's at a high enough percent. I don't think Steve is either, but who knows? Why don't I have sound? Huh, interesting. Sorry, I just couldn't, don't know why I don't have sound on this. I think I've had sound in every other video, but it's fine. We'll deal with it. We'll deal with it. Ugh. I feel bad for Steve. He probably got, he's getting crapped on for having like the most boring amiibo figure. And then uh, for having the most boring amiibo figure. I, I know I just said that, but I'm going to say it again. 
and also being banned from Smash. I just kind of feel bad for him. Because I love Steve. He's got such an interesting play style. I feel like he is still balanced, but... I do understand the evidence behind banning Steve. And honestly, I don't care. I don't play Smash competitively. I'm literally doing amiibo tournaments, for Christ's sake, but... Ooh, is Terry going to go for the Buster Wolf here to end off the stock? Because I feel like if he does, that's de that's basic. Oh, no. Don't tell me this is going to go to sudden death. Oh, no. Sudden death. This, be, this is our second sudden death of the game. Ooh, but Terry's got go in this. That's dead. Terry is officially lost, which means Steve versus Duck Hunt is our next matchup. Oof. Poor, poor Terry. Did pretty well that game, but lost to the sun and death. But this brings us top to the right side of the bracket with Inkling versus Bowser Jr. Which is going to be an interesting fight because we do have two Inklings on the bracket. But honestly, after watching that last match with Alex, I, I don't know if it really means they have a high chance. And also, last tournament... Bowser Jr. was, I believe, in the top. No, I'm completely wrong. Because it was Ryu, Duck Hunt Dog, Villager, and Min Min. I, I remember that. I'm, I'm totally not stupid. And honestly, if I had a look at the rest of this bracket, like this entire bracket, my money might be on Samus winning. Samus or Min Min, I think, might take it. Because they both got projectile spam. And both their first matches are against heavies. But then their next matchup could either be against an Inkling or a heavyish character. Which could leave it so they could take an easy final sp uh, po uh, placing. Well, I mean, they have to fight each other too, so. But honestly, we're going to go with the newcomer's win. So we're going to choose Metroid Dread Samus for our winner of this bracket. But who knows? Who knows? And honestly, I might just start sp uh, doing a few... Uh, bracket videos or tournament videos because I am absolutely loving these. Like, I'm just looking forward to being able to do the next bracket video every single day of the week. Like, every time I get a new Amiibo, which might not happen for a little while, at least until I get my new job. But, it, I'm really enjoying this. I don't know why, but <laughs> these have just been a really entertaining sort of stream of videos to do while I just take a little hiatus from doing Minecraft videos, which I do have a new video created or well almost done i've just got to build the whole process of the video but trust me new minecraft video coming soon i won't promise when mainly because minecraft is kind of just a little burnt out of me right now but i don't stay burnt out of minecraft for too long i know it's been a while but then again i did go on a little break from doing videos because of fair and sickness so yeah it's been about a two weeks since that hiatus which is normally how i mean two weeks since the hiatus ended Ooh, Morton went for the kill and Inkling swept. Cleaned up shop. Ooh, but Bowser Jr. also loses the final smash too. Ugh. I feel bad. And is that going to be a kill? No, it's not a kill. Come on, can we get a kill? Morton, don't let this be the end of your bracket. Come on, man. I'm rooting for you to be Inkling. <laughs> because, I mean, like, we've got two Inklings in the bracket. <sighs> also, I know in my last video I said I would get a random amiibo, but it was the other Inkling I got. I got the Inkling Boy Blue amiibo. So, yeah. But honestly, I think I'm just going to go on amiibo spending spree. I mean, like, I've got to save up for two more Skylanders to complete to do a whole playthrough of the games. But, yeah, I think a spreading spree on Amiibo sounds fun. Ooh, final smash. Yes, Bowser Jr. sweeping the top of the bracket already. Now, will he have to go up against our semifinalist? I mean, our second place last time, last tournament, or his own father? Well, I guess we're going to find out now, but kind of ar arbitrary for me to ask. Dang. Bowser versus Min Min. Money is on Min Min. Come on, we've got Min Min the Heavy Stomper or Bowser. I mean, like, I know Bowser's kind of busted in the amiibo world, but <laughs> this amiibo has not been trained at all. Oof. 
Min Min's already spacing. Only a 2% hit, but... Ooh, Bowser. God, this is going so slow already. Oof. God, I'm just imagining it now. E-M-M-I in Smash 6, if it ever happens. And I've already got the amiibo to it. Sorry, I'm just fucking having like fantasies about a character that I want because the figure looks cool. I don't even know how Metroid Dread goes. I, I might wind up getting it during Christmas time, so who knows. I think that's where I'll get like the bulk of video games that I wouldn't normally play buy for myself. Like Breath of the Wild. Not the Pokemon games. I've already got both of them pre-ordered. The Pokemon games, Metroid Dread, Splatoon 3, probably Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Uh, I'm just thinking of sm uh, Amiibo, uh, I mean, sm games in Smash or Nintendo games. Splatoon 3, <sighs> Skyward Sword, Breath of the Wild. I've already got, I already want Bayonetta 3 myself. Well, I don't know how the game's going to play yet, so. <laughs> I don't know. But I'll have that list out soon. Ooh, Bow whoa. Oh, Bowser's down a stock. Sorry, I completely missed that. Ooh. Dang, poor. Wow, I, I don't know how this keeps happening, but I I'm right. Mid Mid is about to stomp the crap out of poor little Bowser. I think we can just count this as a Min Min stomp again. Because Min Min has so far taken two stocks and we're at the lot one minute mark. I'm like, Bowser could theoretically take a stock, but my money's already on Min Min winning this. Oh! <laughs> I can just shut up and stop talking. I mean, even if this goes to sudden death, which it probably won't, this is a matchup between the Heavy Stomper and Bowser Heavy. So I, I think somebody's going to kill this stock. But, I mean, like, even if they go to sudden death, I feel like Min Min will win, right? I can't be wrong again. <laughs> yes. Oh, dang. I don't want to be wrong. I I'm not even picking favorites. I just don't want to be wrong. Please, game, don't let me lose. Oh, no. Bowser's got Final Smash, which might draw out this time limit. And, of course, the amiibo won't even see it coming. No! <laughs> Min Min, our runner-up from the last tournament, has just gotten killed. I'm like, our last tournament bracket is turning out pretty true with one of the St uh, Minecraft people winning, the winners of the, la uh, the newcomers last time winning, but, dude, no, Min Min, back to the bottom. I think she got first out last time, too. So, I mean, on the very first Amiibo tournament, so. I mean, to be fair, she did go up against, didn't she go up against the winner? I'm not going crazy, am I? I just had to keep pulling up my own YouTube videos to see this. Yeah, no, she had a round one fight with Incineroar, so I can't really count that against her. But Samus is kind of getting stomped right now. Not going to lie. Wait, what? why is Samus just leveling up like crazy? Samus was a level 30 when I put him in, right? <coughs> I've just got to ask that to myself real quick. Dude, this Samus Amiibo isn't fighting. Did I just, like, train it with the... I, I trained it with the other two Amiibo, Incineroar and Villager, plus myself. Is this Amiibo just learned to just hide and parry and dodge? Oh, no. Okay, so I'm wrong again. Neither of the Amiibo I thought was going to win, win. So, I think Samus just lost, and so did Min Min, which kind of makes me sad, because I was really looking forward to seeing my newer Amiibo win something, but, you know, like, completely shut me down. Ooh, is this? Oh, Animal Crossing, which means Villager stages up. Dude, Samus, you're just sitting here getting curb stomped into the dirt. I feel so bad for my life. If Samus can just avoid getting hit. For another minute and 30 seconds. 
I love how I'm talking about oh, me, uh, Sam is just avoiding getting hit. Yeah, no, there's no way this. Di oh no. This is this is a DK dub. Yeah, no, Samus is already done. GG Samus. Wow, poor uh, Metroid Dread Samus and Skyloft Zelda just instantly out in round one. Completely shutting down my hopes of using the Newcomer Domination as a meme again. Well, I didn't use that name, but Newcomer Sweep. Dude, Samus! I, to be fair, this is the first time in Amiibo history we're going to have a whole fight without the Amiibo taking damage, right? <laughs> Dude, I've got to retrain this whole Amiibo, don't I? Sheesh. I think I might just record another tournament bracket right after this. Just have some fun with it. Just see as of how much I enjoy these brackets. Hmm. I'm just thinking about what I want to do later tonight. Because I really don't think I have time to build what I want to build in Minecraft. So, yeah, I think I'm just going to do another Amiibo tournament. Or figure out what I'm going to do for the two amiibo that I want to do things for. Or need to do things for. You know what? Four amiibo on the back burner of having to do videos for? Yeah, that sounds great. That sounds like a genius idea. Also, DK wins. But I'm not amazed. Did he really take zero damage to you on all that? <laughs> oh, okay. Inkling versus Bilith. Bilith or Inkling boy. I don't know which I want to win. I honestly kind of enjoy Byleth as a DLC fighter. I like his design. I also like his moveset. The only issue people have is he's a Fire Emblem. That's it. I am like, out of all the Fire Emblems, Robin and Byleth are like the two most original, so. <sighs> it's going to be sad if another Smash game comes out and it doesn't have the full roster. I know it's really hard for the people do. Uh, I mean, Sakurai to do the full roster, but I'm gonna be sad to see the huge giant roster go away, because I think it might be one of my favorite parts about Smash Ultimate. I mean, if we could just get Smash Ultimate number two, like Mario Kart 8 Deluxe with some more characters and some more DLC fighters, I I could live happy for the rest of my life without another Smash game, just as long as we could keep getting updates to Smash Ultimate or remakes of the game, just because of how much fun this one is. And, I mean, possibly one day, maybe another amazing thing like Subspace Emissary. Ooh, Byleth avoiding the Nabbit. Dude, these dudes are just... Oh, yep, yeah, that's it, Byleth. Goodbye. No way, Inkling Boy, just take... Let the... Du oh. Oh, no. Oh, no, Inkling Boy. Oh, jeez. Is this going to be a double Inkling just out? I think it might be. I think this might be the first time Byleth has moved up in a bracket. I've got to double check this. I have to keep double checking my sources. I.e. my own YouTube videos. Because apparently I can't remember how they went. Ooh, is this Inkling Boy gone? Yeah, dude. That's it. Poor Inkling. Oh. I feel so bad for Inkling in this situation because he just got killed by that Nabbit. Also, yes, this is. Uh, Byleth did lose his first round in the first Amiibo tournament. And I believe he did in the second Amiibo tournament, too. Oh, Inkling, use the final smash. Don't go down without taking a stock. Please, my man. You're a brand new, I randomized you. I think every amiibo I've gotten this week is just going out round one on purpose. On porpoise. Porpoise. I sure do love the word porpoise. Poor, poor inkling. I'm just going to keep repeating this until he dies. And yes, last... Tournament bracket, uh, Byleth did die first. Dude, Inkling, no! Don't be the first character to get three stocks. Not only in the Amiibo tournament, but in this bracket. You're the first one to lose all their stocks. You're also the first to win Byleth has had. Dude, you know how embarrassing this is for Inkling? 
All right, well, that's the first set of Amiibo done. We're now moving into round two. Ryu versus the Pikachu. Hello, Pikachu. Sorry, I'm just thinking of names on if a ami certain Amiibo wins. Or just if in a certain Amiibo, what, how this tournament bracket is going. The newcomer's destroyed. <laughs> Last time it was the newcomer sweep, but now it's the newcomer's getting destroyed. So that leaves our bottom placing being Skyloft, uh, Loftwing, and Zelda. Alex, Ivysaur, Terry, Inkling, Min Min, Samus, Inkling. Wow. And again, Pikachu and Ryu with probably the most even start to their matches. I think both of these two have had like the most even matches throughout the whole thing. Ooh, I was about to say, oh, dang, Pikachu got that. He learned from his mistake against the, uh, yeah, against uh, Alex. I couldn't remember who Pikachu fought around one. Ooh, is that it for, oh, dang, I thought that was a Pikachu stock down. Pikachu starting to pull ahead here. Now is who's going to get the Smash Ball, I think is the question. Because Ter Ryu could even up this match. Or Pikachu could take this match and run away with it. With a Smash Ball. Honestly, it could go either or, in my opinion. And I feel like either or would still wind up with a decent lead for Pikachu. But honestly, I don't think counting Ryu out is a very smart idea. Because, I mean, Ryu was one of the runner-ups in the last one. Semi-final-ish. <laughs> Semi-final-ish. And just... I don't know. It's a little hard to believe that somebody who did so good would just lose so easily. Yeah, it looks like Ryu's at 100%. This might be it for the poor, poor Ryu. Because he's about to get... I think probably going to get killed by Chonkachu here. He's just going to continue to get his butt kicked, isn't he? And I think Pikachu's going to get his final smash here soon anyways, so... I think even if Pikachu doesn't take a stock now, I have a feeling Pikachu will get his final smash by the time the next stock comes along. Yep, that's final smash time, buddy. I'm sorry, Ryu, but... Ooh, that combo, though. Oh, poor Ryu. That's it for his tournament time. Which means Pikachu moves on. Even before it's declared, I think it's fairly obvious. Wow, we're already at 30 minutes for this Amiibo tournament. Interesting. This is going to take a while. Oof, we've still got one, two, three, four. Five, six rounds left, and we're at 30 minutes. Whew, sheesh. I mean, like, these matches can only last how long? It's, like, three minutes each at le most. And then there's just the in-between time of the brackets. Next up, we've got Duck Hunt versus Steve. Now, this one's going to be an interesting one, because the Alex and Steve, well, the, talk about them as the same character. I've done pretty well in all the brackets we've had. Well, at least one of them has. But now I'm kind of just waiting for it to happen. Sorry, I'm just looking at Amiibots real quick. I actually kind of want to put in an Amiibo into this. But I don't know how. I kind of feel stupid for not knowing how, but... Hmm. Interesting. But, back to the match against Steve and Duck Hunt. Two of the best, probably, fighters in this tournament. Outside of our two beautiful winners, anyways. And, yeah, no, this is already going interesting to me. They're both ignoring the Smash Ball. Both at, like, 50 to 55%. Ooh, Duck Hunt pushing ahead to almost 69. Not close enough, buddy. Not close enough. And honestly, I think... I don't know who's going to take this, because this is... These are honestly probably two of the best fighters all around throughout all the tournaments. But, huh. 
you know, I should start awarding points for every placing in these amiibo tournaments to see who's gotten the most points throughout them. And then win, uh, and then just do like a rankings bracket to see uh, to get like a ranking system in for each of the amiibo. For example, like poor little Byleth over here would be at one. So for like a round one win, you get one point. For a round two win, you get two. For a round three win, you get three. And then for the finals, you get five points. And then if you win the uh, actually instead of getting yeah awarded five points. And then after that, you're just like it's not not just excluded from the ranking, but you're at the top of the ranking no matter what. Until we start having amiibo tournaments, like you're all tied for first place. I might do that. That could be interesting. Ooh, Duck Hunt taking the first stock, but we're already a minute in, so Steve not being able to kill Duck Hunt here seems a little stupid, if you ask me. Unless Duck Hunt just stalls out with a bunch of final smashes, but. Ooh, Duck Hunt going in for that far hit. That's a little far-fetched, if you ask me. Oof. Poor Duck Hunt, just going for this smash ball. Maybe he... Wait, me No! <laughs> yeah, no, I think that's a dub for Duck Hunt. <laughs> because he got him at the top of the state. Oh! Oh! Steve is still here. And he is not messing around, which means Duck Hunt might just try to stall him out for the next 10 seconds. Ooh, this Nabbit could be... Oh! Nabbit. No. Oh! Oh! Oh, sudden death! Dude, he just... Duck Hunt just saved his own opponent. Wait, why aren't they doing anything? Oh, Steve avoided it. Oh, the footstool? Dude, Steve just got pushed out! Okay, that was actually kind of exciting. Alright, Duck Hunt moves on to fight Pikachu in the semifinals. I think this could be the first time either of the next two over here get to the, even the semifinal round. Bowser Jr. and Byleth. Have either of them even made it? Well, I know Byleth hasn't made it past his, uh, his, their first round. Well, his in this case. But has Bowser Jr. ever made it past his first round? Sorry, I'm now questioning my whole sanity. This is intriguing. If my sanity is going away, oh wow! Never mind. I, I I really need to do a Minecraft video. I just realized it's almost been a month since I've uploaded anything Minecraft. Okay, so Bowser Jr. has never won. Uh, has not won a first round in his first bracket. And if oh never mind, he beat. Oh wait, no, he didn't. And uh, he beat Byleth in his first bracket. Okay, so his first tournament win was against Byleth. Okay. Ugh. Yeah, okay, I need to do a Minecraft video. I've been procrastinating way too long. I've even gotten everything I need for this next project, which is, like, most of what you need for this uh, thing I'm going to build. But I I've just been procrastinating doing it. Oh, Bowser's already down a stock, dude. Is this going to be Bowser Jr. wins against his own father? Or is this Bowser Bowser takes another comeback? Honestly, it could go either way. Oh, Bowser Jr. just got stomped out of existence there. Bowser Jr. getting grabbed. Bowser Jr. getting let go of. Bowser Jr. licking, the <laughs> licking his father. Yeah, no, I don't think I enabled Pikachu stage... I don't think I decided what Pikachu stage was. Huh. Interesting. This can only proceed to get more and more interesting. Bowser just coming in with the side smashes and only the side smashes. This is interesting. I'm actually really intrigued to see who wins this. Because Bowser has had a history of making comebacks throughout this tournament. But... Oh, but Bowser Jr. was completely destroying a, a Bowser. I don't think this will go to sudden death concerning Bowser's in this bracket, which means, honestly, if I had to put my money on one of them winning, I think I would say Bowser wins this. 
Yeah, because Bowser Jr. is going to continue through this bracket as is. I mean, going to continue, unless this goes to sudden death. Because Bowser is just going to keep hitting huge hitters over and over again until he wins. But unless Bowser Jr. is just smart and stays away from him. But uh, this is really hard because Bowser Jr. has control. But Bowser's just got reckless heaviness on his side. Yeah, no, Bowser Jr. is getting hit by that. There's, I was about to say, there's no way Bowser Jr. dies to that. Final Smash. Yeah, no, that's sudden death. Okay, who's going to get this? I, I genuinely think Bowser Jr. might just sit there and let it get hit. But I think Bowser's slow enough that Bowser Jr. could just hit him. Yeah, no, the lick sudden death. I think that's twice that Bowser Jr.'s won with a lick. Is this going to be like our loser's upset? Is Byleth and Bowser Jr. going to hit the big leagues today and one of them win? <laughs> I wouldn't be amazed if it could happen, but... Dang, Byleth or DK? Honestly, I think DK could take this. Because B DK is heavy enough to just kill his opponent. Wait, has ba DK made it past his first round in the bracket? He didn't make it past his first round in the Min Min fight. And did he make... <laughs> Sorry, I'm not questioning all these bottom tiers. Also, I'm realizing how little I've been uploading lately. Huh. Just while this match goes on the background, I'm just commenting on my YouTube channel. Honestly, that's basically what this is. Watch Amiibo fight while I comment about my YouTube channel. Um. Oh, wait, I'm on the wrong video. Oh, DK did almost make it to the finals last, semifinals last time, but he got smashed by, by Incineroar. I'm noticing that a lot of the good players that have been done pretty good in future tournaments have all gotten stomped out by Incineroar in the first tournament. <laughs> oh, Steve's stage. This could be an interesting stage, especially for a heavy to be punching on. This could give Byleth a few good hits of surviving. And then, see, like I said, that probably that had a good chance to kill Byleth if it wasn't for the blocks. But these blocks make everything just so weird. Ooh, there's the Smash Ball. I don't think either of them should go for it, honestly. Because they're going to lose their final Smash meter. No, Byleth. Oh! Ooh, that was such a... Oh, but Byleth loses his final Smash. Interesting. But then again, DK's final smash meter is gone completely. Even though DK is kind of taking out Byleth here. Just taking out the trash, you know. The one who has never made it past a round to one before today. Ooh, DK continuing through the bracket. Oh, DK got hit. Which means we have 40 seconds left in a match that has taken this long to, for two pe people to lose a stock. This could be a sudden death hit here. And depending on which stage morph they go with for the final sudden death, I honestly think DK might get swept by Byleth here. The semifinal is Byleth, who had zero points before today. Yeah, I think four tournaments and I'll do a ranking video for everyone with points. Hmm. Ooh, stage morph back. Five seconds. And that's the time. Sudden death. Ah. Dude! Byleth just sat there and let that happen. You deserve that, Byleth. You deserve to get destroyed there. Alright, well, it looks like we're on to our semi-finals. Pikachu versus Duck Hunt. And Bowser Jr. versus DK. Now, who will move on to the finals? I think Bowser... Ju I mean, I think Duck Hunt made it to the finals last time. So. 
I kind of hope Pikachu makes it this time, but who knows. I think it'll be fine either way. I think it'll be an entertaining finale. Oh, Duck Hunt didn't make it to the finals. He made it to the semifinals and got beat up by Minmin. The f second place. But last place in two tournaments now, so. Dude, Duck Hunt is kind of taking up the percent. I think Pikachu is really good at slowly dragging up percent without getting hit too much. Just because of all the aerial capabilities they've got. With all the multi-hits. Ooh, Pikachu just took a huge hit there. They're all point they're all point one percent off of each other for there right then and there. Yeah, no, this could honestly go either way because I feel like they both do the same thing. They slowly rack up damage and then they hit for big time. Or well they go for the final smash, but you know. That's besides the point. Honestly, I think I'm fine with either or winning this. Because I think it'll be an interesting final finale no matter who's in the semifinals. With the uh, just who's in the semifinals, I apologize for my misspeaking again. My misspoken language. Dang, Pikachu's racking up points and killing the ducks. Oh, dang, poor Pikachu and Duck Hunt. They only got three ducks killed. Okay, I'm realizing now that maybe saving the progress of the amiibo might be a little bit of too much of a shtickler thing to do. Because I think some of these amiibo could be level fifty by now if I didn't accidentally forget to reset uh, to to if I didn't forget to save their progress last time. Huh, interesting. Is this gonna be a final Smash Ball moment for Duck Hunt? Because I feel like that's what Duck Hunt needs to get this stock off Pikachu. Ooh, stops the s stops the Smash Ball hit, but. Oh, I was about to say, did du uh, did Pikachu just get that Smash Ball, or was it Duck Hunt? Ooh, is this going to go to Sudden Death? Yeah, Pikachu's at a final Smash meter, and honestly, I don't think Pikachu's got enough time to spam this out now. now. Because I think Pikachu's gone to fi uh, Sudden Death every game he's been in so far. Huh. Dude, poor Duck Hunt. Just getting absolutely camped out right now. Even though I think this will go to sudden death. Actually, I think both Duck Hunt and Pikachu have had a decent number of sudden deaths now. Ooh! Pikachu swept at the last second. Completely beat by Duck Hunt. Which means Duck Hunt, instead of getting knocked out in the semifinals, gets to continue to the finale for the first time. Which means he will go up against either Bowser Jr. or DK. Huh. We've got Morton, well, as Bowser Jr., and DK on a flat map. Both of these people, uh, opponents have done pretty well throughout their tournaments, so. I mean, to be fair, uh, both their first rounds were kind of lackluster. <laughs> I mean, even their second rounds, I think Bowser Jr. has had a better track record throughout their thing. Because DK's first round, he had nothing happen because Samus just sat there and did nothing. His second round was against, like, the worst character in this whole tournament bracket, Byleth. And then his la semifinal match is against Bowser Jr., which has had a pretty lackluster first round. And he fought his own father in the next round. Huh. Ooh, Bowser Jr. could get this Smash Ball, theoretically speaking. I mean, to be fair, anybody could get the Smash Ball, even me! Is this where P uh, DK... Uh, yeah, that's it. Completely beat out of existence. Sorry, Bowser Jr., but you just got beat up. DK just got lost his first stock. 
Honestly, the smack dab tied at the halfway mark. Oh. Oh! Oh! That could be an interesting thing to happen. Ooh, wow, okay. So, they both kind of just lost their smash meter. And... They're both just tied. Sorry, I'm getting a little tired. It's almost midnight here. I might wait till tomorrow to record another video, but I need to record that Minecraft video. I need to stop procrastinating. Huh. And we're just going to keep watching this. Maybe Bowser Jr. will hit this. Who just... Oh, DK lost. Which means it's Bowser Jr. and Duck Hunt in the finale. This this is interesting. Uh, so we've got Bowser G So we've got Duck Hunt. Round one had to destroy Alex, one of the semi uh, one of the second places throughout these tournaments. Then he had to fight the sudden death king in sudden deaths, Pikachu. And now he is in the finale against D Bowser Jr. But Bowser Jr. has had wait, am I missing a match? Oh, wait, I've got ba Duck Hunt's bracket so messed up. He fought Ivysaur, then Steve, and then the Sudden Death King, and now he's against Bowser Jr. And then Bowser Jr. had to fight Inkling, then his own father, and then DK. Both my Skylander Superchargers Amiibos have fallen to Bowser Jr. today. Oof, wow, this is, this is going to be an interesting finale. We've got Duck Hunt coming in fast with the he with the heavy 14%. But Bowser Jr. keeps up pace with a 43% on Duck Hunt. But then again, at the in every single one of these matches, just about, Duck Hunt has been in a lower percent of their opponent in the first 30 seconds and has still proceeded on forward to tie up the score. But then again, I feel like I feel like this might come down to final smash power. Because I feel like Duck Hunt doesn't have a great has a great final smash for knockouts, but Bowser Jr. doesn't. And I think this is kind of just gonna be a match of who can get the final smash and kill first. Or this could be a match of who gets tossed around by Duck Hunt. <laughs> Duck Hunt or Bowser Jr. Huh. Oof, that, oh, wow, Bowser Jr. coming up. It might have higher percent, but managed to get the kill on ba a Duck Hunt here. Nice and early, before the half sec uh, half mark. But then again, he's still got a stock on Duck Hunt. Even if it's not a stock by much. Bowser Jr., I would just get hit. By Duck Hunt. Or not. <laughs> that is exactly what you didn't want to happen. You wanted to get hit by Duck Hunt without dying. That's what you wanted to do. Just for one more hit there. Oh, D Bowser Jr. almost gets the knockout there. I think this might be a come down to final smash power of Duck Hunt. And then if Duck Hunt just stands there and lets Bowser Jr. hit him again like that. Oof. We're going into the stage morph. Oh! Oh! Duck Hunt might have just gotten really, really lucky there. Ooh, but is Duck Hunt going to die to that? I feel like with this matchup and how it's gone so far, this could go any way. Ooh, can Bowser Jr. clutch up? Or will Duck Hunt just stall out Bowser Jr. on the bottom of the map? I think that might be what happens here. Ooh, that's it. Bowser Jr. loses. I'm calling it now. Yep. Duck Hunt has won the ami his uh, second Amiibo tournament after coming from a near finish last time. Which means this time's winner goes to... Duck Hunt, which I have absolutely no clue what I'm going to do with again. This is another case like Villager. There's so much to do, but I don't.
But now how did Duck Hunt win this? He had a fight Ivysaur, which was actually pretty easy on his part. Then he had to go off and completely destroy Steve in the second round. Had to fight the Sudden Death King Pikachu and then fight Morton without Sudden Death. But that's going to conclude this Amiibo tournament. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, I hope to see you guys next time. And goodbye. Um, one sec, this is not working out.